Scorpio, how are you? This is your daily tarot card reading. It's for Wednesday. I was a bit tired yesterday, so if you did watch the collective reading, I'm sorry about that. <laughs> Apologies, but it was so late in the day when I um, uploaded it and it was too late to redo it by that point. But my little girl was uh, poorly in the night and anyway, she's better today, but that's why. So let's see, ooh, flirt. You had this card the other day, didn't you, Scorpio? <laughs> I like this one, flirt. Um, extend your light-hearted energy to others. Ooh, very nice. Okay, so something is going on here. Okay, what else have we got? Ooh, embracing the shadow. So you might be exploring some flirtatious energies, some energies that perhaps you haven't delved into for a while. And also just embrace it because you've got here rhythms. No, this is the the natural um sorry the natural rhythm of life here you know the natural rhythm of life you've just got to go with the flow and something is definitely wanting to be expressed within you scorpio you know so here we go um yeah you've got speaking your truth just this is just being you being you expressing your truth and you know enjoying yourself right Let's go a bit deeper. <laughs> oh, ten of cups there. Oh, queen of swords. I do see Scorpio really coming into your power more and more at the moment. Um, and it's like you're letting go of a stressful time where you may have felt like your power was taken away from you. Um, you're coming into much more emotionally fulfilling times. Um, you may have had to affect other people around you but you're moving on from that I don't think that's really going to worry you anymore quite honestly because you're moving into happier times I mean this is like possibly a new partner or just like a much more emotionally fulfilling situation in your life happening um, and you've got the queen of swords it doesn't matter what gender sexuality you are you you've got queen of swords energy that means like basically no one's taking advantage of you no one's messing with you now and you're much more clear on your, you know, what it is you are manifesting. Um, and it's, yeah, it's fun. It's flirtatious. But it's some, there's an emotional aspect to this as well that's nice. It's making you happy. Um, let's see what's going on for your person. Okay, so there's somebody here. Now, this could be even to do with a, an ex or something. But speaking your truth, because somebody conflict there's conflict there or competition <laughs> there could be different people trying to get your attention and you're going to have to speak your truth and be like yes no yes no like that um or or whatever it is but yeah somebody is having conflict about what you're doing maybe or like i said there could be lots of different people wanting your attention and you're having to just be you know, just brutally honest about what you're feeling and what you're thinking. I feel like Scorpio is back in the power seat here. Um, look inside yourself, examine what's it causing you to feel this way. So you're being really honest with yourself and whatever caused you stress, I think you're just moving on from it. Uh, whoever, whatever it was, it's like, yeah, I know how that made me feel. And I know why it made me feel like that. So now you know what it is you really want to manifest. Um, I'm going to contact you. I need to speak to you. <laughs> so somebody has definitely got their eye on you. And it doesn't to them. It won't matter how many people you're talking to. Because they want you, right? So this is interesting. Um, you will just be very direct with this person. And also, you're playing it safe. I don't let people attach to me. You're not going to let anyone draw you in too close till you've made your decision. And I like that. <laughs> I like that a lot. Like I said, you're the, it's, it's like Scorpio is the one holding the power. You found your sacred self. You found you're back in your sacred self. Look at that. This is one of my favourite cards, actually. Unleash your spirit. Express your gifts dance to the sacred rhythm of life and you've already got the rhythms so your your spirit guides are getting you to really really own your energy and and be your energy and live your life your way and that does mean sometimes 
you know, people see your shadows or you have to embrace your shadows and say, you know, I can't neglect this part of myself because this is a very valid part of who I am. Um, so anyway, exciting, uh, Scorpio. I feel you're headed towards a much more emotionally fulfilling relationship um, or situation in your life. And you're going to have fun while you're doing it. And you're going to be very direct and you're going to be very clear. So that's the message. If you do like it, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe. If you like one to one tarot, I'm here. Just contact me. I'm sending you lots of love, lots of peace, wherever you are on Gaia.